Hey, what's up, YouTube? Hey, it's Josh from Bearded Assassins. Hey, just wanted to um, come on here and say, you know, thank you for all the subscribers. Um, on IG, we just hit, you know, a little bit over 1,300 followers now, so we're super stoked. Um, and we'll continue to, you know, keep providing the customer service and, and um, providing the best beard care that we possibly can provide. So, Thank you for just all the support and all the love and everything like that. We appreciate it. Um, so tonight's gonna be a little bit different. Wanted to come on here and um, give you guys kind of an update what's going on. So on May 8th, uh, me and Ariel, we got married. Yeah, that's right, we got married. Then um, my kids came, so they're still here for about another, uh, another week or so. Uh, we're gonna be going out of town um, this weekend, and we'll be back next Wednesday. So if you're gonna order anything, please order before Friday, so I can get everything out by Saturday morning. <clears throat> so anyway, bam, that's what we're here for tonight. Uh, I got a tobacco review. So I don't know if, how many people uh, follow us on Instagram. Um, I don't know how many people are into pipe smoking hobby or anything like that. Um, I am. Uh, I'm definitely a big fan of the pipe tobacco, uh, smoker pipes and cigars and all that good stuff. So what I got for you guys is a pipe tobacco review. That's right. I'm going to try this and see how it goes and hopefully it's good. So, if you follow us on IG, you know the last couple days I've been doing um, reviews, kind of kind of small reviews and stuff like that, on my story, um, and it's and it's been um, a really good tobacco. Uh, I've been really surprised. Normally, I don't really like aromatics too good or too much too good. What the fuck. Um, but. I've been actually really enjoying this one. Um, so, without further ado, check it out. It's going to be McBaron's Vanilla Cream. Loose cut. It looks backwards on the screen, so hopefully it's like the right way whenever you guys see this. So, um, I saw a thing on Pipes and Cigars where they had the McBaron's blends. I think they still do the whole month, I think? The whole summer? Something like that for 20% uh, off. So if you guys like McBaron's blends, definitely go to Pipes and Cigars and grab whatever you guys can grab. <clears throat> but I'm going to show you uh, what the tobacco looks like. Bag hell. So, it is super, super nice. Super nice. It is a really nice blend to look at. Um, so whenever you are opening up this tin, the first thing you're going to smell is vanilla. Uh, the next you are meted and greeted with just this beautiful tobacco melody. Um, the tobaccos that are in this uh, are going to be... Um, Age Virginia's and the uh, modern McBarian Black Cavendish. Then they blend it with an exceptional vanilla flavor. The selection creates an outstanding blend with superior flavor, unique aroma, and distinctive taste experience. So, um, I watched a few reviews on this before I bought it. And a lot of people were saying that the McBarrens, they were having issues with tongue bite, it was getting too hot, um, not, not enough flavor, stuff like that. And I was like, you know what, it really, it sounds really good. It sounds really good. I wanted to eat it out of the tin when I smelled it, but um, I was like, screw it, everybody's palates are different. Mine can be different from everybody else's. Uh, normally what I smoke 
is um, like Virginia's, Virginia, Virginian Paris or Vapors. Um, every once in a while, if it's like a, if it's like an aromatic, it's something like a Black Magic Woman by Just For Him. So it has like Perique and Latakia and stuff like that still in it. Um, so I've tried a couple other aromatics and the problem with me is about halfway down the bowl, just no flavor. It just gets ashy, nasty, and then by the time I'm like a third way, uh, two thirds of the way down into the bowl, it's just so wet. I can't even either, I can't either finish the bowl or I have to wait until it, like the bowl dries out and stuff like that. Just not fun for me. So I was really shocked at this. Basically, what you get is whenever you, whenever you light it, you're gonna get you know vanilla. It's like a creamy vanilla. Uh, like a fruity, tobacco-y flavor and smell. As you tamp it down, as you relight, and as you start puffing again, you get this beautiful, like, just, it's almost like a, like, plummy, vanilla-y um, scent that's in the smoke that you get. And it's just really, really good. Um... I, I was like, man, I'm just not gonna probably like this stuff. But packed a bowl. Um, I packed a bowl. My first bowl was in a cob. It was in my great. No, was it great Dane? No, spindle. It was a spindle, spindle cob or something like that. So smoked it in that. It smoked really good, and I could just smell the the aroma. I was just like, oh my gosh! And I drank it with coffee. So freaking good with coffee. The next day, I put it in my Peterson 307. Um, it was a 307 system pipe uh, with the P lip, and that smoked really freaking good, super super good in a Peterson. Um, tonight, I'm trying it in my my Morgan's Bones, the uh, straight billiard. So I was gonna I'm just gonna show you guys. Uh, I think I have about one third of the bowl left or something like that. It's pretty low, um, but if you can see, it is straight up like a white ash up in my bowl. So when they say, when they say it, it definitely burns down to white ash, this stuff really burns down to white ash, and it is is great. Um, anybody that likes aromatics, anybody that wants to take a chance on a vanilla aromatic, I say. This one, I definitely, definitely highly recommend. Um, this one, not only you get good flavor, but the flavor sticks pretty much through the whole bowl. Like by the very, very end of it, you know, it's gonna be ashy a little bit. Um, the flavor's still kind of there. So it, it goes pretty much through the whole freaking bowl. I was super shocked. So you're getting your money's worth. Um, it's really good tobacco, burns really well lights really well, packs really good, uh, and you're just able to, um, you know, control the, the whole tamping and everything. It just burns, it burns nice. So, um, I, I, I mean, I'm, I'm literally drinking like, I'm, I'm drinking coconut water and it's going to go with the coconut water. Coffee is great with coffee. Uh, I mean, it's not something that I would smoke or pair with like a whiskey or something like that, but in morning, great smoke. What else? What else? What else? Oh, yeah. Oh, and I am now trying out uh, the plum cake now, too. So I'll be doing a review. I'm going to try to get it up before the weekend. So I'm going to have another bowl of that tonight. I had one last night. Uh, if you follow me on Instagram, it's it's up there still, I believe think so <clears throat> but it should be um, but I, uh, I guess that pretty much concludes the review I'm sorry if it's not a great review this is my first uh, tobacco review but what the heck right what the heck um, but anyway I hope you guys have a great night and um, if you guys don't know we're having a sale at the moment on beardedassassins.com get any kind of bearded um, all your beard needs and we appreciate everybody, everybody that 
you know, has subbed us on here, everybody that has followed us on Instagram and shows their support and their love and everything like that, thank you so much. Uh, we, we really, really, really appreciate it. Um, I kind of changed the, the thing, I guess the category, on, on our uh, YouTube video because honestly there's only like, there's only so many things that I can talk about like beard wise. Um, and then I also kind of wanted to include you guys on, you know, more stuff that I enjoy doing as well. So that's kind of why I changed it. It's not just about the beard company. It's not just about beards and products and stuff like that. It's going to be about kind of just hanging out and pretty much just hanging out. Um, but if you guys like this video, please give me a thumbs up, uh, subscribe, like, share with your friends if you got any. Um, but thank you again and uh, thank you to all my new subs sorry I haven't been putting any videos out uh, it's just been it's been crazy busy um, just with everything going on but anyway you guys have a good night and uh, I'll catch you later